Pinocchio is a browser that lets you install and run all kinds of AI apps locally, as easy as web browsing. All it takes is one click, which triggers various scripts that automatically install and run apps. The problem is, someone still needs to write a script for each app. But what if we can automate even the script writing? Meet Geppetto. Open your terminal and enter npx Geppetto. It will ask you for the project name. And you can enter an icon URL, which Geppetto will automatically download. Next, if you need to clone a third-party Git repository, enter that too. Now let's go check it out on Pinocchio. We see the project, click through it, and we see an install button, click it. Once the install is finished, we see a start button. Click that to start. And that's all, Geppetto has just generated some scripts that let you spin up this AI app locally on your machine and it's up and running. So what just happened? Geppetto follows a convention that's been widely adopted thanks to hugging face spaces. It makes an assumption that projects have a requirements.txt file for installation and an app.py file for running the app. But you can also easily customize these commands. Let's take a look at the scripts generated by Geppetto. Let's check out the install script. The first step clones the git repository you entered earlier. Then the next step calls a dedicated script for installing Torch. If you don't need Torch you can comment out the step altogether. But let's quickly look at the Torch install script. It's basically a bunch of pip install commands, customized for each platform. Now back to the original install script. Here, Dupetto assumes the repository contains a file named requirements.txt and installs it, but you can customize these commands too. Now let's take a look at the start script, which actually launches the app. The first step assumes the repository has a file named app.py and runs it with Python. Finally, the sidebar menu interface can be programmed with Pinocchio.js. The Pinocchio.js file describes the user interface for the launcher. You can even make the menu change dynamically over the app lifecycle using the API. So, that is Geppetto. Build AI app launchers effortlessly.